Hello and good morning everyone. Uh, today I'm going to give you my two cents about this huge change that we are facing in the, in the retail industry at the moment. The thing here is that uh, quite many companies in Finland has already started the change. They have been uh, having lots of different kind of development actions to reach, reach the, I wouldn't say end status, but some kind of a, a true solution towards the customer around the topic. But unfortunately, in Finland, we still have lots of companies and retail companies, especially that haven't yet uh, started the journey about the change. First, I would say a couple of words about the past. To understand the future, you also have to understand what was the past all about. So this was the, the old world of the omnichannel business. Actually, uh, one might say it's more like multi-channel business in a way. It started already in 19th century when, when the first brick and mortar retailers started to think that, okay, we should have a mobile sales unit. You might call them also this kind of a traveling salesman. But again, coming more nearer to the present times, we have also seen different kind of different channels like mail orders and maybe the one, one of the, the latest in a way already coming from the 1990s, the, the rise of the e-com. However, the thinking has been that they are completely separate channels serving separate customers, and as you can see, the customer is in the bottom. This comes from the thinking that from the retailers that having different channels is, is more like finding out the efficiency of selling. And, and that is the thing that still many of the companies, retail companies in Finland and all around the globe actually, are still struggling with. Okay. Uh, what would be then the solution for the thing? I'm coming from the one of the biggest IT integrators in, in, the, in the world. The room is filled with lots of technology guys and everything. Then I go, come here and show you this. It's not an architectural view. It doesn't include the words artificial intelligence, virtual reality, 5G, AR, ER, ETL, whatever, I'm just showing you a very high level picture about the change in, in, in the thinking. The, the huge paradigm shift in customer behavior. And good thing here is that now we have put the customer in the center. Uh, actually, we didn't do that. The consumers did it by themselves. By, by finding out more easier and, and more convenient way, they started to think that, okay, we should be in the middle. They, they would be uh, running the sales in a way. And, and that actually means that we have to be able to start to think about the world in different manner. Instead of having separate channels, instead of having separate products, custom segmentations, everything, we should start to think that what is the consumer in the middle thinking and combining all our services around that. It, it's, it's coming from the story. It, it, it's, the idea is that the customer will start it, his own journey from web or from the brick and mortar or wherever in social media. And then we have to find our ways how we can seamlessly uh, help the customer to move from a different channel to another channel, and at the end of the day, do the sales. From the ecosystem perspective, this is also changing the thing. Uh, in the past, ha having this kind of a multi-supplier project, it typically meant that, okay, there is a supplier serving the the uh, hardware and network, and they're uh, a supplier serving, serving the software. But actually, when we have this kind of a model, it all starts with the service design. It's not an IT thing as a such. And, and there are so many different players on, on, the, on the way that we have to find a way how we can help our customers to find a best 
possible combination from different players on the market, on the different segments, to ensure that, that the customer experience will be met. This was actually my story. Uh, we have a put on, on, on the uh, back of the room, so please come and, and visit us and, and we'll tell you lots of more about how the retail will evolve in the future. Thank you. Thank you, Karim.